You can call me BB. I thank you BB. so much for joining us here live in Dallas, Texas. All right. Well, it's my pleasure. I love Texas. Oh, Texas is a great, you know, it's a whole nother planet, but it's yeah. the greatest place on earth. Longhorns. That's right. <laughs> Alan, I've lo I've watched you in the A&E hit series, Fix This Yard. I wish I could get you to Texas to fix my yard. <laughs> well, you know, I can be bought. Okay, okay. We'll talk later. But right. I'm so serious. I just bought a house two years ago, but I know what people are going through when they ask you to fix their yard. Tell me a little bit about Fix This Yard, and then tell me about spring, how we can do this. Well, Fix This Yard was a renovation show based on yards, front yards, and it was all about educating the homeowner how to do the work themselves, which was a great thing because it empowers them, much like um, the conversation we're going to have right now and all the tips that I'm going to give your viewers. All right, then. We like that. Okay, so what can we do? It's spring. We're, we're actually having spring. I don't know where you are. Most people aren't having <laughs> spring, but we're having spring. Yeah, we're having spring, too. And, okay. Um, right. Yes. Go ahead. And so, what can we do for the, with our yards? Well, now is the time to. Well, first you got to step out into the yard. That's the big. That's that's the first big step. You got to get out there, start to assess the yard, see what needs to be cleaned up. A lot of times the yards kind of sit until the sun comes out. Time to clean everything, cut the dead back, see what we're working with. So now we got a blank slate. Step okay. one. Step two. We look at the soil. What are we working with? What happened over the winter? Do we need to amend it? Do we need to add anything to it? Do we need to aerate, punch holes in it so it has better drainage? And we wanna add a nice organic, really slow acting fertilizer that helps the lawn get prepped to accept the new plants and everything we're gonna bring in in a, in a couple weeks. Okay, any new product you got to make this easier? Oh man. Yes. <laughs> All right. So I, I have what is uh, uh, the coolest tool I have ever owned because my life went from being an annoying nuisance every time I watered to uh, uh, like a uh, trip to Disneyland or something because the, the Gilmore Leak Free System, they, the engineers took the garden hose, all the accessories, changed all the fittings. Every single component is leak free nothing leaks from this hose and you change the uh, fitting in 1.3 seconds and you can have the hose on and change it you never get wet and it's almost impossible to believe but it's true I, I was thinking that you know because we are we're novices out there in that yard with those little fittings and things like that so something that really works would be revolutionary right and it's so rare that we find something that actually does work you know, people are trying and it doesn't work, but they did it. They, it they, they hit it out of the park. So very excited about that. That way I don't waste water. I don't get wet when I'm out watering the lawn. And um, I have a lot more fun because I'm not so annoyed with the leaky hose. Well, I like that because also, too, a lot of cities are going to go under uh, water restrictions. Dallas is under water restrictions, uh, whatever your city is. Mm -hmm. So we don't want to waste water. That's just it. We want to save water, save money, and their price point, it's, it's comparable to a, a standard, you know, a garden accessory. So I, I, I don't know how they sell it for so cheap. It's a great thing. Um, I would recommend you buy it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And would you like to send my audience on the web to get some more information? Oh, heck yeah. Tell your audience to go to GilmoreLeakFree.com. That's GilmoreLeakFree.com. Or tell them to go to the hardware store the home improvement stores, because they're on shelves right now. And they're going to be selling out fast. <laughs> I know, because I'm going to get one this weekend. I'm Good. definitely getting one. Alan, if you could tell me one thing about being on uh, fixing the yard, fix this yard, what was the most exciting thing for you? Why do you do this? The most exciting thing for me is working with the homeowners and watching them learn and empowering them with... Um, skills with tools that they'll be able to use as they live in their house and, and seeing people that never went into the yard actually enjoy it and then want to keep going and take pride in what they're doing. Well, Alan, we'll be watching you on Fix This Yard. We'll continue to be inspired by what you do. And thank you so much for telling us about the product. Well, thank Help you. Save so us a little time and hopefully some money. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Take care.